Hi everyone, uh, this recording will be covering step-by-step walkthrough of the SSCP order onboarding flow. So firstly, the customer will be placing an order. Once the order is booked by EBS, the customer will be receiving an email to redeem the subscription. So something similar to this email. So here we have the onboarding uh, link. On clicking on this link, uh, it will uh, start with the onboarding uh, process. So it will uh, redirect to CSP portal. So we need to log in. Yeah, on clicking on sign in, it will be redirecting to the CSP portal. So meanwhile, uh, we can go through the email like what it what it contains. So this this email will contain the information about the order details like order ID and uh, subscription ID and what is the unit and uh, the quantity purchased, start date, end date, seller type. So all these details will be uh, mentioned in this email. Also, the purchased edition detail will be provided here. So in this case, like we have a uh, purchase standard so standard or description will be provided in case of multi-line order um, where we have a mix of standard advanced or enterprise so uh, the edition with the high precedence will be uh, described here and next we have the onboarding instructions so we need to click on the invitation email uh, sorry the link in the invitation email and we need to log into the uh, cloud portal uh, which we have done now and um, so once uh, subscription is um, redeemed to an org we will be redirected to cloud subscription manager so let's go back to this yeah so after login like we will be uh, landing into uh, this place so where we have the uh, the subscription detail again the quantity is 50 start date end date and what is the total list price and what is the discount and what is the total charge after the discount and uh, the order detail will contain details like service payment method purchase date currency and what is the user and we have the option to invite other users to redeem uh, this uh, subscription so on click on continue so here uh, we can either select or create an organization in case of uh, we already have an existing organization we can search here and uh, we can just select that org and we can click on continue and in case if you want to create a new organization we can just click directly here on the create new organization so here we can give the name So I just give the name as stage demo recording and the address will be taken uh, default same as the business profile and I'm clicking agree to the VMware terms of service so on clicking on continue it will ask for the confirmation to select the address and uh, we are selecting this address and um, it is uh, again reconfirming to apply uh, the subscription to the newly create newly creating work which is stage demo recording so on click on apply subscription so this will be uh, redirecting to the cloud subscription manager after clicking on this uh, onboarding so here a new org will be created and on top of that this order will be assigned to this particular org so here as you see like we have the org created stage demo, demo recording and um, it's trying to fetch the order details yeah so now the subscription is redeemed here here we have the subscription subscription details the subscription id and the started in date total quantity and what is the units and the status it is activated and um, in order to complete the onboarding we need to uh, uh, complete this onboarding uh, flows so here we need to select the region so in order to onboard the services to the selected uh, region like we we can select either united states australia united kingdom we select either one of them and we click on continue so that these services will be 
redeemed on border to this region. So if you see here, we realize log insert and we realize operations. So these two are redeemed against the uh, uh, United States region. And in the SAS entitlement onboarding to selected region, so what this will do is it will uh, attach the SAS services to the org. You know, SAS entitlement is completed. And uh, so for the SAS customers, uh, if they don't want to use the on prem licenses, so they can. Uh, uh, directly go to the services and uh, they can be uh, able to uh, they can start using the subscriptions so here so this is a subscription which is uh, on board and we can go to the cloud service so now we should be able to see the services attached here so we are ops it's attached and we are alive so these two services are attached and we can uh, launch these services and in case of uh, on-prem uh, uh, customers and uh, they need to uh, wait till the license generation is completed so once this is done they will be receiving an email with the license provisioning email So as mentioned here, like SaaS entitlement will get activated in a couple of minutes and the on-prem license generation, this will take a couple of hours. So you'll be receiving an email notification after the license is generated. And if your license is not generated within 24 hours, like we can contact a customer support, VMA support. Yeah, now the on-prem license generation is completed. And uh, we'll be receiving an email for the same. So this is the order that we have placed. And uh, this is the license uh, key provisioning uh, email. So here we have the order ready and order details like the edition and all the other details will be mentioned. Like start date, end date, everything will be here. And this is the link to go to uh, realize uh, Cloud Subscription Manager. On clicking on this, like we'll be redirected to the CSM portal. Uh, to the org where we have redeemed the uh, order and this is the org id so it has redirected to the stage demo recording org on clicking on apply license like uh, we have to select the customer connect uh, account so in order to configure this like we can go to settings and we can click on custom connect and we can add the account and um, on clicking on apply like this is the license generated and this license can be applied to the on-premises uh, uh, services and uh, there's other way to uh, get the license uh, through the customer connect uh, portal and this is the license generated for the standard order of quantity 50 and the end date is 2026 um, 15th february